Good morning, Pipsqueaks! It's 9.25 on the East Coast, 6.25 on the West Coast, and it's time for some coffee crossing. And thank you, Pokemon Fire 84 for the follow in the pre-stream. So, how's your morning? Mine's been doing pretty good. I'm working on a few projects downstairs in my printer. I hope to save up enough money to get that camera set up for it and to uh, start streaming my 3D prints, which would be cool as an added thing. But I can feel the I can feel the fall in the air. I can smell the spooky season coming. So let's go ahead and head on over to Fog Harbor and visit with our friends. Because I've got a few things that I've been working on over there while I was off stream. Alright. Get the controller together. There we go, and there. Huh. That's weird. Hmm. It started up on its own. Put that away. <laughs> Okay. Now then. Yep, it's still loading. There we go. Yay. up whole trees crush rocks this is the power this this power is yours if you eat fruit or other foods yes yes it's incredible i'm wondering how many people actually use rescue services because they got lost on their island i mean honestly i've used it but only during that maze the mayday maze thing Good morning, everyone. Oh, good morning, Isabel. You make every morning that much better. You really do. Right now on Fog Harbor, it's 8.28 a.m. on Wednesday, September 27th, 2023. This may not count as news, but I have a cautionary tale of sorts to share. Oh, no. What could she possibly be talking about? Occasionally, residents complain that they purchased a work of art, only to later realize it's, well, fake! Oh my. They all note that the fakes were purchased from a boat anchored along the northern shore. Woo! Excuse me! Let me get some water! A little gassy there for a second. Mmm. What you do with your bells is your business. But I ask that you please be wary of this boat. Stay vigilant. Mm. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. I wonder what she's talking about. What boat could she possibly be? Hmm. Well, that's different a penguin at my post box speaking of uh, Jolly Red the graceful painting which is a fake from Renee uh, check this out Cedar I visited home a while back and got to watch my cousin's kids that little rug rat is so stinking cute I know I got a tough reputation, which is fair because I'm tough. But little kids just 
get me right there. Don't tell anyone, Renee. And the dream ticket from Luna. Yes. Okay. We'll go ahead and open this. And this. This goes in the stack there. The fake art goes into the garbage. We'll put away... The iron, clay, and stone we got yesterday. We will move the extra shovel. down here for now. And now, actually, take out 10,000 bells and we start looking for the glowy spot. Let's start up here. Uh, oh, well. It's not a glowy spot, but it's a fossil. That's something. Okay. She knows fishing. Let's see. Let's not disturb her. Now then, we gotta find the glowy spot. Okay. No, we'll go over there in a bit. The glowy spot sometimes can be a real hard job. Sometimes it could be just about anywhere. Tell me, do you see the glowy spot? Click on the glowy spot! Found the glowy spot! <laughs> there we go. Since we're getting ready for spooky season, we need to take care of our pumpkin patch. So let's grab the watering can. And we'll go ahead and water our pumpkins. There we go. All muffin, all oh, muffins, <laughs> all pumpkins. There, at least, have been watered. 
But I did make another pumpkin patch yesterday off stream. Or to be more exact, to be more accurate, she did. My other account did. I was one pumpkin short of this kind. But yes, we are growing pumpkins for spooky season. Extra pumpkins for the spooky season. Always a good thing to have. Okay. Now she said... Now... Isabel did say something about the northern shore. So let's head up there and see exact what the Is that a shark? Kind of late in the season for a shark. Oh, darn it. I jumped the gun. Or you might say I jumped the shark. Okay. Ooh. <clears throat> Let me get in the character. Well, if it isn't my favorite cousin. Glad to have you back aboard, Charlie Red's treasure trawler. Oh, store policy. You know it, I know it, you know it. We have a limit of one art piece per customer per day. Choose wisely. Okay. Sunflowers. Never a fake. This is woman holding an ermine, which I believe is actually the real thing. I believe. Oh wow. <clears throat> um, excuse me. I believe they're all real today. I will definitely get sunflowers though, because Picasso is one of my favorite artists. I won't lie. An awful lot of folks have been asking me about buying that flowery painting there. <laughs> but maybe the price scared them off. So, I'll sell it to you for 4,980 bells. Deal of the fall. You in? Well, I want a closer look. Thing is, this one is never a fake. That I know of. I will double check. But I'm pretty sure it's real.
yes, this artwork is always genuine. So, yeah. I just wanted to just double check. Admiring the detail. Can't blame you. It's extremely detailed. Brilliant stuff. And the best part? All that detail could be yours for just 4,980 bells. <clears throat> Sold. Ah! Ah! You're not going to regret this. I'll just take those bells from you. Yes, it's all there. Congratulations, you are now the proud owner of a flowery painting. It's been a pleasure doing business with you, cousin. I'll get your art ship packed up and shipped out tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry about that. Whew. Always love doing Red's voice. Mm. Got a plush unicorn and a bag of something. You won't regret this. Sorry, I'm not that didn't get the character for that. Okay. Let's see if I get a second chance at that shark. That would have been the final shark of the season. I can't believe I botched that. I just... Got a little trigger happy. Nope, you're not a shark. I thought shark season ended last month. See what this message is. Uh, dear soon to be best friend from Klaus, while taking a stroll on the beach and soaking up the exfoliating salty air, I struck the IY gold. Uh, as they say, sharing is caring, so here you go. I'd be honored if you crafted it. What is it? An iron wood clock. Do I know this one? I do know this one, so I'm going to put this one over here. We're going to put this away. up here we're going to get something out actually why am I getting stuff out I wanted to put stuff away putting away the rock the stick the fossil and the clump of weeds we're going to sell Hello, hello! Welcome to Nook's Cranny! Well, we're going to sell these two recipes. What do you need today? Well, I want to sell. I know it's only 400 bells, but nobody was picking up... No one was picking up recipes off of my beach anymore, so I just decided to sell them all. Sounds great. Hey, it has been a long time, Sonic fan.
Good to have you back. You're welcome. So what have you been up to? A lot has changed on my island. For instance... I moved Toby's house up here. And then I traded Toby in... To get Shino back! There she is. Actually, why am I... What am I thinking? Hold on. Okay. I've got three spe... I picked out three special outfits for Shino. I already got her one of them, which was the um, ancient robe, which really looks good on her. That needs to go back. But these are the out these are the other two outfits. The flashy kimono and the Miko outfit in red. I think I will give her the flashy kimono today. go and drop that and now to give oh not much going on huh well I seem to be having a little bit of a lag problem. Okay, maybe a lot of a lag problem. But let's go ahead and give this to Shino. Good morning! Okay! Okay. This is for you. Oh, what is it? It is this. Oh, what is it? It's a mystery. I'm going to open it now. Oh my gosh. Is this a flashy kimono? Yes, it is. Time to try it on. Oh, so excited. And it looks so good on her. Oh my gosh. I love it. The color. The colors are, let's just say they're perfect, because they are! I feel kind of bad being the only one getting stuff. Here, take a judge's belt. Seriously, she looks so good in that. She also looks real good in the, um, in the ancient robe. Now, let's see. What should I do? I'm going to get something out. Let's see. Don't have enough pumpkins. Giant clams? No, I'm not going to do giant clams today, but... I got all these manila clams. I'm going to grab these real quick. Because they don't stack.
Ooh, my pockets are full. Well, I'm going to go in and do what I was planning on doing anyway. And that's craft them all up in the fish bait. Craft them up in the fish bait, get them out of my... And, and, and make up some more... I'm glad you like the outfit that I got for Shino. I think so too. I think it looks absolutely fabulous on her. And since she's going to be a permanent villager, that's the big reason why I decided to, um,. That's the big reason why I decided to, um, give her special clothing. Because she's going to be a permanent villager. I'm not giving her up. I'm never going to give her up. I'm never going to let her down. I'm never going to run around and desert her. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. I think I'm done? Oh my goodness, I was right! And let me get that last one. And make one last fish bait. There we go, we're all done with... We're all done getting all of that... We're all done getting all those clams out of my inventory, and we've made them into fish bait, so we can use them if we need to. I'm gonna put some things away. Like the fish bait. I just took 16 spaces and turned them into two. Now then, let's see, what can we give out to our villagers today? I could give out fossils, but that would just be a pain. Um... I'll give them, I'll give everyone a giant clam. Or, let's see. No. No, weeds would be silly. Um, let's see. What color should I go with? I'll go with orange.
And... You know what? I'm just going to go with the cherries like I usually do. I'll go with the cherries like I usually do. But she does look absolutely fabulous in that outfit. Okay. And the thing is, I'm not worried about Shino's painting picture because I already got that. I also got, I also already got um, Kurlos's photo because he gave it, he was one of my first 10 also. Kind of weird that they both would show up around the same, well, no, it's not weird that Shino would show up around now because I was planning on that. I'd actually been working on that. I wanted to get her before Halloween because Halloween is her birthday. It looks like my stream is frozen. Yeah, okay. I'm going to do a quick uh, stream dump and hope that that helps with the lag. I mean, I'm going to keep the recording normal so that my VOD's fine, but a quick stream dump every now and then sometimes helps. Especially when I'm lagging as bad as I am today. Alright. And that's enough cherries for everyone. Ah, 
That's assuming Curlos is actually accepting gifts right now. Yeah. Strangely enough, I kind of built that bamboo grove there for Shino, so I'm glad she's actually using it. I can put that away. Hey, it's a fossil. around here. I guess that makes most of them down by the beach, probably. Walker's in his house. <gasps> Uh-oh. Cephalobot's thinking. That's not a good thing. What is he thinking? Oh, man. You know that feeling after you stay up all night talking with friends and it gets quiet and you just want to keep talking and hanging out. Unrelated, what are you doing right now? Can I come over? Sure, why not? The time is now. Let's get moving. Okay. We're headed back to my house. We made it! Yes, we did. I'm just gonna sit here and watch TV. See if he'll come and join me. Or maybe he'd like to come down to the cafe. What? You're going to leave me here all by myself? No. I'm staying here. You thought you were abandoning me for a second there? No, I was going downstairs. Well, I should probably hit the road. Donk, donk. Alright, I'll see you later. Hey, I had a lot of fun today. Thanks for the memories. Bye. Now, I didn't mean for him to go out to, to do that. I really wanted to take him downstairs to the cafe, but oh well. Actually, did I forget to... No, I did. It was on already. Okay. Actually, while we're here, why don't we go ahead and see what they have in the Able Sisters today. Hey there, welcome to the Able Sisters, where we sell fashion made lovingly by Claw. Go ahead and talk to... Cedar, I just wanted to thank you for everything you've... For always being there to help Label. Oh no, she's doing this again! She talks about you all the time, you know. She says the outfits you pick out are always super inspiring. Oh, come on. Stop this! And then she runs back here and starts sketching it furiously. It's wonderful to see. Mm. You've done so much for all three of us. Thank you from the roots of my quills. I need the changing room! Changing room. You need the changing room. You need the fitting room. Go right ahead. Yes, please. Whew, she got me all flustered. Let's see, um, school jacket, no, 
No. Oh! This is the ancient sashed robe that I gave her yesterday. I'd give her this one, but I like her I like the pink one with the purple better. And it looks better on her, I think. Let's see. No. Fake nose. I would, but it takes away the beard. Okay. Flashy animal boots. Don't need those. Okay. Nothing really of interest. And I'm feeling a little better now. All done? Nothing caught your eye? Not really. Thanks. Please come again. I will. Now then, let's see. Is anyone down here by the beach? That's weird. Usually there's someone on the beach. But Walker is home. Hey, Cedar! It's great to see you! Wah! Do you want this? Do you want this? Oh, are you giving me? What are you giving me? I'm giving you this. What's inside? I'm going to look. Some cherries. Yummy. It looks so good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Cedar, I'm going to lay on the floor and eat that. Might even share with the bugs. Here, man. It's a baby bear. Enjoy. Wow. Okay. Bye! So, Sprinkle is out and about. Angus is home. And he's wearing my outfit. I love it. What a glorious day, eh, kiddo? Go on, make yourself at home. Oh, uh, here's a gift. Huh? You're giving me something? Yes, I am. <laughs> Wonder what it is. I'm excited to open it. Some cherries. Smell darn good, too. I'll give this a real good home in my belly. Gahaha. -ha. I don't want any freebies. Here, have a long Chanel cardigan. Okay. Ooh, pardon me. Whoa. <laughs> Okay, he's out and about. But Kurlos is home. Where is everyone? This is actually kind of concerning. Oh, he's building in the middle of his house. I love it. Oh, Cedar! Welcome to Le House de Le House of Carlos. What you doing? Glad you asked. I am making a crest door plate. The recipe came to me in a dream. Do you want to hear more about it? Either the dream or the crest door plate? Uh, yes. Uh oh. I already forgotten about the dream. Forgotten my dream. But I have the recipe written down right here. You can have it. I don't know this one. Give it a try, Cedar. If I can make this, anyone can!
Huh, okay. Sweet! I learned a DIY recipe for a crest door plate. Shirley! What have you gotten yourself into? Nothing! And don't call me Shirley. Uh, this is for you. Seriously? For me? Now, what do we have here? Hey! Gothic Witch! Me! Yes, me! Yes, I went live! Yes, I went live without you. I am sorry. Not my fault. Not my fault that you weren't here when I went live. Oh, could you hear my dummy rumbling? Is that what you got me, these cherries? Just gonna tuck it away for five minutes from now. You know, I can't accept this without giving you something in return. Let's see. How would you feel about a battle rap, eh? But yeah, I don't know if you if you were here lo here when Carlos was here last. I have Carlos and I have Shino back. In fact, I've been giving Shino clothing. And here's Stella. Hello, Stella. You always, you're always welcome to stop in and relax here. Ah, uh, da bing. Uh, do you want this? Oh wow, really? Yes, really. And I am so sorry that I am lagging. I don't know why. I don't know what's up with my bandwidth today. Oh, this is great! It's some cherries! Thanks! That's so thoughtful of you. I have something here for you. A pajama dress. Okay, you have fun with that. Okay, we've got Rudy, Mallory, Sprinkle, and Cephalobot to find. There's Rudy. I see ya! How you been, mush? Here's a gift. Really? What is it? I gotta open it now. Oh, I can't wait. Some cherries sound delicious right about now. Thanks. I'll eat this later. Time to flex me gratitude muscles. I want you to have an after school jacket. There's Mallory. Well, if it isn't Cedar, I am hoping you've come over to say hello, Quack. Well, not exactly, but yes. Hello, and do you want this? This is for you. Aw, you shouldn't have. I know I shouldn't have, but I did anyway. What a nice wrapping job. Shame I'll tear into it right away. Some cherries! My, my! Thank you, Cedar. I can't wait to try this. How can I thank you? Ah! Why don't you take this reward of Valerie's photo? <gasps> we got a photo today! That means we get a new snooty. Okay, that's one photo. Just one. 
It's just one. We got Sprinkle and Cephalobot to find, so... One moment, I am being passed a memo from my staff. Okay. And by my staff, I met my mom. Somebody lounging amongst my fruit trees? It wouldn't be a first time for this to happen. I mean, it's just not very common. Because I put them up here specifically to keep people from lounging around in my fruit trees. Okay. Excuse me for a second. Sorry about that. I didn't want to drive everybody deaf with my sneezing. Okay. Cephalobot. Oh, we meet again. Yes, we do. Do you want this? Oh, for real? Oh, I can't wait to open this. Oh, could you hear my tummy rumbling? Is that why you got me this? Cherries. Just going to tuck that away for five minutes from now. I can't let you walk away empty-handed after you were so generous to me. Here, you have to take a... An... Edo. Period. Merchant. Outfit. Okay. Let's see... knows new house, she knows new outfit, which I absolutely love. She looks so amazing in it. She looks amazing. Um, she knows, sweetie, hold still. I'm sorry about this, but... Whoop! Gotcha! I caught a flea! The curse! It's lifted! Are you even serious right now? I had fleas! Grody! I agree. If you hadn't taken them off of me, my pop star career would be ruined before it even... before it even started practicing for it! You've totally saved the day. And my celebrity status, Cedar. Thank you so much! Happy to oblige! It's a good thing I happened to spot it before he started talking to her and she started talking about how itchy she was. 
If she started saying itchy tasty, I would have been worried. And let's see how many people get that reference. Oh, she's not in here. And... Oh, there she is! Hey, Sprinkle! Good morning, Frappe! Here's a gift. For me? Yes, for you. Ooh, what is it? What is it? I'm gonna rip it open now, okay? Let me see! Some cherries! Yum! I'm gonna eat this so fast it's gonna be rude! Thanks a bunch! Here, I'll trade you. It's a mixer, and I hear you love those! Actually, I hear they're really good for making frappe! You just need to freeze the coffee and then put it in there first. Yes, I know how to make a frappe. Should I toss something? Yes, I'm going to throw away. Oh, I can't throw, I can't throw away the flea. I swear I'm bringing more dramatic... I'm I'm, be, I'm bringing more dramatic and dramatic by the day. The princess has graced you with her presence, huh? <laughs> yes. Welcome, princess. Let's see. Let's go over here by the ocean. And we will release this flea into the water. There, go drown. By the way, kitty, I want to show you something. I know I'm lagging. I'm lagging pretty bad, actually. But actually, you just saw it. Hey, kitty. Hold on. Oops. Yes. I know. I'm I'm lagging that badly. I'm at least a good minute and a half behind. I'm a, I'm a I'm a good minute and a half ahead of my stream. I was open I'd see you today. Get some coffee. It's 200 bells a cup. Absolutely. I have said on stream. The thing is, it's going to take me a minute and a half to get there. <laughs> oh. I brewed this cup specially for you. Drink up, go. Go. Yeah. I'm typing to Kitty because I am so far behind. I haven't even entered the coffee shop yet on my stream. In fact, I'm just entering. Oh, yum. 
I found the blend I want to drink for the rest of my life. Go! Cool. Thank you very much! Okay. Let's call Shino over for some coffee, too. Oh, no! I haven't bought all the stuff from Nooks. Yes, I would like to bring over an Animal, uh, animal Crossing friend, yes. Yep, that's Shino. Yes, I am sure. I'm bringing her over every stream for coffee, because it's fun. Thank you for waiting. We've contacted Shino. The customer you contacted will be here shortly. Please wait inside for her arrival. Hail Hydrate. Well, you heard her. Drink up. Yes, I'm losing a lot. And it's not stabilizing. I'm at like 65.8% loss. It sucks. Ah, look, it's Cedar! I mean, of course it's you. You're the one who, like, invited me here. Yes, I am. Do you invite lots of folks here to the, to the cafe? Because I need to hear all of their gossip. Dish for me. Nope, you're the only one I invite for the most part. Well, except for my friends whenever they're coming over to visit. Like Kitty. She's pretty cool. I bet you'd like her. You can't bring outside food in here. Or we could totes. Get to nomming on some lime sherbet together. Uh, yes, I am sure it is not your storage. It's on my end, because I'm looking at my stream right now on my computer, and it's bad. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's not you. Okay. Relaxing alone with a warm cup of coffee is nice. But it's even better talking with a bestie. Yes, it is. And you are my bestie. You had the best timing. I was just thinking I wanted a cup of Brewster's finest brown water, okay? I would not call it that. Especially not with Brewster so close by he could hear it. That's like calling tea hot leaf juice. Okay. Well. I'm being asked to go to Nook, so you enjoy your coffee. And I'm on my way. Actually, it's almost time for Renee to wake up, so we'll drop by Renee's real quick and then go to Brewster's. I mean, then go to the Nooks. Because Renee just woke up and we can give her her gift. Morning, Cedar. Eager to hang out? Yo, yo, yo! 
this is for you, you, you. What is it? What is it? I want to see. This is awesome. What's in there? There's nothing tastier than some cherries. Thanks. Thanks. I could eat these for days. They're scary good. Yo, yo, yo. Surprise gift exchange. Here, take a floor seat. Okay. Bye. Yeah, I know my stream is bugging. It's freezing up for some people. It's, free it's frozen up for me. I'm just having a bad internet day. And I don't know why. Actually, hold on. Let's see, what is... Nothing serious is really eating up any serv- any problem. It's... It's just my ethernet's being weird. My sending and receiving are just real low today. It's just my internet. Yes, I know. But I'm, at least I'm recording it today. And like I do every day. So it'll be on my YouTube tomorrow. For people to, for people to watch. Without it being all messed up like this. Anyway, I'm just going to wait here until it shows up on my I mean, I have nothing better to do right now. Actually, I do have something I need to do. One moment, please. I'm going off camera slightly. Got what I needed. I've got to figure out what is wrong with my internet. I don't know if it's a connection problem, like a loose wire or something, but I'll figure it out. I mean, I've dropped over 65% of my frames, and it isn't getting any better. It's staying at about 65%, which is driving me banana nanas. But I have been recording it, so yeah. If you want to catch up, if you want to catch the whole thing. 
if you want to catch the whole stream, you can check here. Tomorrow. Yes, I do have a toilet. No, I don't think that's a toilet. And a nail set. But that's not a toilet. That's a bidet. Oh, it is a tankless toilet. Okay. Well, I have the money for it, so I will buy it. And she says she needs the nail set. A nail art set. I think I'll buy it. Okay. And now I am off to go do some mail. Yes, they probably would see me losing frames. But it's not like there's anything they can do about it on their end. I'm sorry. I'm sorry is giving you a headache. I really am, kitty. But I'm going to go ahead and mail these to you. Hmm, they have a card stand here. Looks like I can send a message on a card for 200 bells. Ready to send a letter? Yes, let's send one. Where do I want to send it? To a friend. Which friend do I want to write to? Okay. All right, delivery come fee comes at 200 bells. All right, we'll get your mail mailed. There we go. Yes. Yes, I know. All right, well, get your mail mailed. I thought it was a bidet. But I already bought it. As you can see, 
Because I am buying it right now on my stream. And I've already sent it to you. Letter sent. Thanks for your business. Now then. The reason why I went off off camera is because we're going to get a new snooty because Mallory gave us her picture today. Okay. Alright, welcome to Nookstop, a Nook a multimedia terminal from Nook Inc. Once per day access, one day, fifty bonus miles. Alright, we're going to invite a camper with an amiibo. Alright, now let's just Okay, that's fine. But, ooh, well. One just jumped out at me! As I was trying to pick one out, one jumped out at me. I wonder who she is. She must be really excited to come to the island, though. We'll see. Yes, I do. It's ready. That's Gloria's amiibo! Would you like to invite her to the campsite? Yes. Ah. Okay. Yes. Ah! Hello, this is Gloria. Thank you so much for calling. Is there something I can do for you? What? Visit your campsite. Visit your island's campsite. <laughs> it is a lovely, if unexpected, invitation. I think I'll say yes. I shall start packing most fashionable, my most fashionable outdoor outfits now. Camping chic is all the rage, darling. And now I won't be spitting all over my, all over the place. I have been abandoning my HHP for who knows how long. Ah! Happy Home Paradise, I think, is what she means by HHP. That's the down. That's the DLC. HHP is the DLC for A, C, and H. And if you don't know all those acronyms, you've never played this game. This island is simply stunning. I I don't know what to say except thank you for inviting me. Please excuse my excitement. It's all just so delightfully overwhelming, Quackers. Quackers! Oh, that's even better than... Well, at least it's better than Quack. <laughs> Feels weird. Seeing how I came all this way... I can't help but think it would be nice to take something home with me. Something unique to impress my friends. Perhaps a souvenir to prove I was here. I've got it. How about an aroma pot made right here? I'll make it for you. 
Aren't you a peach quacker? Thank you. My friends will be green with envy when they see it. I do have the recipe for crafting an aroma pot. So I'll give it to you now. But I must tell you, there's one teeny little thing. I'm only here today. No, you will be back tomorrow. And that means I must ask you to craft my souvenir as soon as possible. Terribly sorry for the rush. Oh, it's not a problem. First of all, let's learn the recipe. Uh, okay. Alright, learn your recipe for an aroma pot. Okay. Now, what is the recipe for an aroma pot? Ooh. That, oh, four iron nuggets for that. Three clay. I can do that. I got two new recipes today, which is cool. I'm going to get something out. I'm going to get out... Four clay! And I'm going to get out some iron, actually, as well. Yes. Craft the aroma pot. I'm going to keep crafting because I also want to do The crest door plate. All right. Well, let's put some stuff away real quick then. This and this. This, this, this. This. This, 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 not that, this, 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 and this. Now, we'll make the crest plate. Okay, I'm all done for now. <laughs> when I went camping as a young duck with my family, I loved toasting marshmallows over the fire. I wasn't very patient, so I usually burned them. But I didn't mind, they still tasted delicious to me. It's important that one set out on new travel adventures wherever one can, Quackers. It's the best way to see new things and meet new folks. Not to mention, find new places to shop. It's refreshing for one soul, darling, and travel at the traveling and the shopping. Uh-oh. No wonder she's not asking. I must have put the aroma pot away. Whoops. Get something out. If I'm right, it would be under miscellaneous. Actually, let's... Why? 
sort alphabetically. And there it is. The aroma pot. Oops. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, I accidentally left it and I put it away. Oh, did you finish crafting my fab souvenir? Be a dear, and don't drag this out. Tell me, Quackers! Tell me, Quacker! Uh, it's ready. Wonderful! Simply wonderful! I s And so very authentic to this island. I promise to cherish my fabulous aroma pot forever. Please, darling, I want to give you a sweater on shirt. As a token of my gratitude. <laughs> you fabulous thing, you! You have helped me make some truly splendid memories here. When I get back home, I wonder if I won't find myself wishing to return. Please, do invite me to the campsite here again, Quacker. If it wasn't for the fact she was a duck, I'd say she was insulting me. And I don't know how many people would get that. But to be honest, darling, I wouldn't have thought camping is like this would suit me. After all, I usually loathe going out without basic amenities, you know, like an infinity pool or a heated bidet. But much to my surprise, roughing it suits me just fine. I find it appeals to my bold nature. No, this duck isn't about to let a little fresh air and, un and an unkept wilderness keep her from adventure. Hey, what do you mean, unkempt? I make sure to pick up all the sticks and rocks and pluck all the weeds. Okay, she did have it out. I didn't see it because I was standing in the way. Really, darling, this island is something special. I feel like I'm at my best duck when I'm here, you know? Honestly, I'm not sure I want to go home. Well, what if this was your home? Oh my! What a nice thing to say. Living here would be lovely, I'm sure. It's just, uh, you and I hardly know each other. It all feels a bit sudden. But, but, I'm not saying no, I'm merely saying I'd like to visit a few more times to be certain. So, do invite me to the camp, to camp again, Quacker. I will. So I'm trading a duck for a duck. I'm trading a snooty for a snooty and a duck for a duck. That is just so weird, to me at least. That Mallory, a snooty duck, would give me her photo. And then right afterwards... Darn it, I can't remember her name. But another snooty duck gives me her... comes to visit the island. And at least this one doesn't make me spit all over my microphone and my computer. Yeah, Gloria. Yeah. Well. I don't have a least favorite. I really don't. there what you up to hey cedar i found this epic relax spot during my walk so i'm taking a break sounds good 
That sounds like a great idea, Shino. But Mallory and Gloria. Ah, she didn't have... Oh, okay. The dots under her eyes. All right. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and just drop this off here. That way I can go ahead and... That way, my other account can go ahead and put it up on the wall. Oh! Hello, Martha Taylor! Thank you for the follow! Sorry about the lag. Uh, it's nothing I can do about it. It has... It's my internet for some reason. It's not my computer. I checked. It's just my ethernet for some reason. Maybe I should get a better ethernet... Maybe if I got a better cable. I don't know. I'm going to check along the beach real quick. Actually, I'm going to comb the beach. I'm going to do some beach combing. Because I saw a shark, or at least a large finned fish earlier. And I'm like, it's a little late in the season for sharks. But you never know, I might catch another one. Nope. Nope. Mallory, what's up? Cedar, I have the perfect gift for you. Are you ready? Alright then, it's a painter's overall. I hope you like I hope you find it useful. Quack. I'll be honest, I will not miss doing that. It's fun, and she's funny. And I will not argue that. But spitting all over the place every time she says something, says that, is... Yeah. Don't know fins.
Okay. Alright. That is all of the beach combed. And still no sign of that fish. Of, that, of a shark. Or fin fish, I should say. Let's put something away. Um, now we're going to put away the giant clams. And this sweater on shirt. And these painter coveralls. Oh, and the iron. While we have time, I'm going to head over to Harv's Island and go talk to Cyrus. He's really good at modifying stuff. Ooh. She knows reading by the sea. I feel like I've seen you more today than I've seen anyone else. Ever! That's because I'm... And you're not wearing your new outfit anymore. Let's talk. You really do like your cafe uniform, huh? I see you wear it a lot. Yeah, I do. Mainly because it's, it suits the channel. Hello, Sprinkle. Were you planning on flying somewhere? Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to your one only gateway to the skies, the Fog Harbor Airport! How can I help you out today? Well, I want to fly. Roger! By the way, it looks like you got a Nook Miles ticket on you. In case you feel like using it. So, just to get the paperwork all official, where'd you want to go? Well, actually, I want to go to Harv's Island. Harv's Island? Roger that, good buddy. I can set you up right now, but are you ready? All packed and stuff? Yes. Talking for takeoff! Alright, let's get you airborne. Dodo 1, this is Dodo Tower. Wilbur, you copy? I got a walker, I need a wings, over. Roger, ready when you are. Okay, have a good flight, friend. And when you need to travel, just think, what would Dodos do? Do do do, ba ba da. Touchdown, like clipping coupons and a blowtorch. We are parked and proud. That would be next to impossible. Mainly because it's next to impossible to get inside a blowtorch. Give a quack to wing back. Okay. Let's go talk to Cyrus real quick. Howdy, Squirt! You looking to get something customized? I sure am. All right, leave it to me. So, what's your order? Well, the door, the cr the crest door plate. Okay, regular silver. Ooh, silver and gold. Blue and silver. Red and white. Silver and green. Colorful! Hmm. I'll go with colorful. Do, 
to. Don is about to be delivered. Pretty great, right? If you find anything else that needs a bit of work, bring it here. I will. This is going on my door. Trainwreck Peach Cobbler is reporting Tango Snooker is go. Do you require assistance? Over. Yes, I want to bust Bunsen Burners and bounce back to Orangetown. You think you could do that for me? You want to bust Bunsen Burners and bounce back to Orangetown? Yes, that's exactly what I finished saying. Yes. Roger, let's pack snacks and make tracks. Last time it happened, there happened happened. There's spit everywhere. Yeah. Every time I said that, every time I said quack, I stick out my tongue and I do that to make the sound. Let's see. There we go. This wind flower reap. No, you know what? I'm going to keep it. No, I'm not going to keep it. I'm going to sell it. Oh, wait. Yeah. I want to sell stuff. What exactly am I offering? I am offering you that, this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. Look at all the fine things you've brought in today. Allow me just a moment to run the numbers. And done! 4,560 bells. Sounds good. Thank you. Please come again. Mm. Kind of feel stupid today, Cedar. I checked my storage to see I had an extra of the real left and right wild paintings. I feel rather dumb because I was asking people if they had them. Oh no! Uh, could you maybe check what Kicks and Sahara have? I'm not in the mood to play Animal Crossing today. Well, I've already left the island! I already left. Yeah, I've got some major lag today, and it's driving me nuts.
Oh, well. I'm feeling nauseous right now. Probably because I'm returning back to school in four days. Oh, dear. Yeah, that can cause it. Stress from needing to go back to school. Yeah, actually, a, a lot of people. It reminds them of that. Uh-oh. What are you thinking? Hey, Cedar. So, last night, I had a bad dream. I was in my house, okay? And there was this fish in my living room, floating? And the floating fish, it had a really deep voice. When it talked, my windows rattled. It said, You make trays, you make trays lousy decorating choices. Oh dear. I'm still freaked out, Frappe. Would you come over and keep me company? It helped take my mind off that judgy nightmare fish. Yes, I will. Well then, let's head on over. <laughs> hey, don't be shy. Come on in. I love Sprinkles' house. It's the coolest place on the island. She's got twin pearl pearlescent shell partitions, a pair of shell, a shell speaker. Actually, I think two. Oh, that's a lamp. Don't you just love my shell lamp? I mean, it really sets the mood, doesn't it? I am all about mood lighting. And it really changes the vibe of the place. Don't you think? Of course, no matter where I am, I want the vibe to be awesome, Frappe. Just like, make yourself at home and relax, Frappe. Oh, that would be nice, actually. How do you get into your bed? No, seriously, how does she get into bed? Her bed is blocked off. She can't get into her bed. She doesn't sleep, apparently. Oh, no. Oop. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and sit down. Yes, it does. I am very lagged. And I don't know why.
Yeah. Did the flowers grow? Could I go back? Could I go back to Harv's Island? Is that what you're asking? <coughs> oh, yeah, it's been a day for me, too. No, I am not leaving. Not yet. You don't have to go. A lot of folks would love to spend time with a future famous person, Frappe. Okay, fine, we'll talk. When I moved to a new house, the first few days there, I... This is weird. But it doesn't feel like it's mine. It's like I'm staying over at somebody else's place. But after a little while, like, it turns into my home. <laughs> it's warm and safe. Your own little place in the world. I don't know if other folks go through that, but I do. And I thought I'd tell my bestie about it. Since you're here, do you want to play a pretty tin, a pretty trendy game? Let's play. Let me guess. It's high card, low card. Yes, I could. But actually, no, I can't. If you guess correctly, I'll give you a simple parka. Okay, ready? And start. Okay, get ready. The first card is is the eight. Now I'll draw one more. Here, I'm going to go with lower. Yes. Boom, I've drawn a card. I'm having to communicate through typing with my channel because they're so far behind. I think it's just smaller than the eight. Oh my gosh, it's time to see if you're right. It's seven. Yay, congrats. Okay, now just as I promised, here's your simple parka. Wow, wow! That was so much fun, Frappe. My heart was like... ba thump ba -thump. That's how excited I was. When I lived at home, my room was t was a total grody storm. Mom would clean it up when I was little. But once you grow up, you have to do everything, like, for yourself. So now I fight the grody storm. Okay. Let's see. Shells. 
shells. Let's see. It's fruit. Cardboard boxes. Bamboo. Shells. Okay. Um, shell fountain. Shell table. Shell bed. Shell partition. You need four Venus combs and four conch shells. That's a giant clam and some clay. Uh, that's a conch shell and some iron, some conch shells and iron nuggets. Giant clams and stone, sand other and clay. Giant clam, clay and a stone. Yeah, apparently. No, actually, I'm just looking at stuff right now. Yeah, it was an awkward silence. Yeah, I was checking my I was checking my internet to see what was going wrong. Okay. Is currently playing KK Marathon. My shell bed is the comfiest thing ever. I like to lay on it while I read Fauna Magazine with Miss or Miss Nintendeek. It's so comfy that sometimes I fall asleep. How do you get into it? I wake up with magazines stuck to my face. <laughs> but how do you get in when you got your shell speaker and this partition in the way? And you have your shell lamp and the partition in the way. And you can't crawl in from the bottom. I think I'm ready to go. Heading out already? Well, it was major fun having you over. Let's do this again sometime. Oh, before I forget, I want you to have my favorite song, KK Marathon. It's just a little gift I to help you remember the first time I invited you over, Frappe. Okay. Okay. Now, normally I would be ending my stream right about now. Okay. Yeah, today has been a weird day. So I'm going to go lay down, take a nap, and end the stream. Oh, wow! Hey, look what's on! It's... 
Monster versus... It's Monster versus Robot Hero! My favorite movie! One of my favorite shows. That and Slappy Clobber Town. Okay. Should I get some sleep? Yeah, I want to get some sleep. Oh dear. Welcome, welcome. The binary fields are teeming with beautiful dreams. How may I be of assistance? Well, about my island's dream. I have a dream of Fog Harbor filed under this dream address. Well, I'd like to update my dream. As a precaution, I must first confirm you wish to update the Dream of Fog Harbor. Are you certain? Yes, let's update. Splendid, I shall now connect to the internet in the Library of Dream. Ugh. This place always makes me so sleepy. Ugh. Close your eyes. Picture what you love most about Fog Harbor. Relax. Re. <sighs> oh, I'm awake. I'm awake. I'm awake. There, the dream update is now complete. Each bite feels renewed and refreshed. Well done. Um. <clears throat> Very laggy. And about to lag, I mean, log off. There, the dream update is now complete. Each bite feels renewed and refreshed. Well done. Your dream of Fog Harbor is still filed under this dream address. May the dream of Fog Harbor host many happy visitors. May I be of assistance in any other way? Well, I just want to wake up. I see. Please come again. You are welcome at any time. Whew. Alright, let's wrap things up for now. Do. All right. Speeding, speaking Zodiac furniture, I'm going to be crafting a lot of cancer tables and Scorpio lamps, when I mean a lot, I will need 10 cancer tables and 10 Scorpio lamps. Wow, that's a lot. But we're headed over to my coffee shop for my final thoughts now. And I know... This has been a rough stream. Woo! This has been a stream and a half and no mistake. I've been suffering from lag that I can't find the problem, I can't find the cause of. It may be a 
cable problem. It, I, there's not a software issue. And my lag and, and my, um, the, the, the thing is my, um, stream, my, my internet is like going between, uh, it's, it's just been go spiking like crazy. It's driving me nuts. Wish I could figure out what the problem was. I'm wondering if it has something to do with the school that I live near. Anyway. Things we did today. Besides lagging. We got Shino her second outfit. We saved her from a flea. And we invited her to coffee. Also. Mallory gave us her photo. And we... Uh, so we invited Gloria to the campsite. She's going to be our new snooty. Um, we learned two new recipes. One from Gloria and one from Carlos. The crest door plate, which is cool. Anyway, before I go, as always... Here's my switch code in case you want to send me a friend request and who knows, maybe you'll be able to come over to my island sometime. And before I go, two very important pieces of advice. One, stay hydrated. It's good for your health. And second, no matter what anybody ever tells you, always be you. I'll be back tomorrow. Same coffee crossing time, same coffee crossing channel, and hopefully without the same coffee crossing lag that we had today. Eh.